So how excited are you to be fighting in front of your home fans again on July 12th? I'm so happy to get this card and fight in my hometown. And I make some history last time in my hometown, so I hope so to be a good fight this time also in 12th July. So we see how best men win. She you made your debut, I think was it last December in KL, you won spectacular fashion. So you have good memories of fighting here in front of your own fans. Yeah, I'm so happy to get fight again in Malaysia. It's all my fan there, my trainer, my family. So I'm so excited to be there. And I trained so hard for this fight. Yeah, we'll see how the result after this. Some fighters prefer fighting at home, some prefer fighting away. You enjoy fighting at home more? Yeah, I love to fight in my hometown. All my crowd is here and I feel not very nervous because it's my hometown and everybody be my, by, by my side. So I'm so happy and so excited now. So you've had a few fights since your debut. What have you learned from them? Obviously, they've all been on the road. For me, I learned a lot from the fight, three fight I fight. Uh, I learned, I fight with a big, big name. So I learned a lot from them. And now I study back what my mistake, everything. So this time I will do my best. I will learn all my mistakes and will do my best in Malaysia. Talk about your last fight, I think it was against Andrew Miller. You didn't look quite yourself. Were you a little bit under the weather that night? Actually, when I fight Andrew Miller, I'm not in a good position. I am very, I'm sick, actually. My weight from 70 dropped until 63 in one day. I was sick there, so they, I don't want to fight, actually. After that, my dad said, you need to fight all. So I just fight, but my body is very weak that time. She must be even more motivated to yeah. put in a good performance on July 12th. Yeah, I fight with Saiful Megan. He's a good fighter, experienced fighter. I'm happy to share the ring with him and so excited to share the ring and get experience from him. Some fighters don't like fighting their own countrymen. Are you happy to fight Saiful? I'm not happy at all to fight him. But what to do, this is our job. If I say I don't want to fight this time, he say, so you wait for another time. So I want to fight in my hometown actually. So I say, okay, I will take the fight. Obviously he comes from a Muay Thai background, but he's been predominantly fighting MMA. How does that affect you fighting someone who hasn't fought or a Muay Thai fight for, I think he said about six years? For me, he's a good experience for Muay Thai and he, after that he go to 1FC, he fight for MMA. So he had good experience, but same, he come to Muay Thai again, he cannot take down. He still do fight striking, standing game. So it's nothing for me. Yeah. It's been a great day today. The who's who of Malaysian martial arts have been here. How do you enjoy these sort of days, mixing with Evt and Gianni Suba and everyone else? I'm really happy. I want to tell you, from 7 o'clock morning, I'm, I'm here to all the media, media with Evt, with Aguilantani, all the fighters. So I'm happy to know each other for close. So they treat me also like family. So I'm very happy to know them also. We're good to have media now. It's all about looking forward to July 12th. Okay, see you there. We'll fight good and fight smart there. And I hope I can bring the win for all of you guys. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Cheers.